So without further ado, please stay around after this session is over for the drawing and some other announcements, but it's my pleasure to introduce Duke Spear. You all know him, you all love him, and you all tolerate him. <laughs> Thank you so much for that. Uh, uh, dopo questa sessione, per favore rimanete qui, qui in giro perché ci saranno degli altri annunci e con grande piacere che vi introduciamo Duke Spear. Lo amerete e vi piacerà molto questo talk. Welcome. It's been a year of changes, such as changes of leadership. Benvenuti. Yay! Ci sono stati tanti cambiamenti, tra cui anche un cambiamento nella leadership. How many of you saw Game of Thrones at Jab? Ooh. Quanti di voi hanno visto Game of Thrones, uh, il trono delle spade, uh, a Jay and Beyond? Yes. Tonight, I would like to talk about a couple different things. We have th three parts to the evening. First is a little bit about communicating to technical audiences. Parleremo di diverse cose questa sera. La prima è comunicare a audience tattiche. I don't remember. <laughs> The second involves a little bit of competition, which is why you are organized in pairs of tables with chairs around them. And in wait, <laughs> but uh, so this way. <laughs> the first involves a competition. Okay, la prima uh, include una competizione del motivo per cui siete sistemati in uh, tavoli. We have 12 teams. Avremo 12 squadre. We have cheaters in the back who need to move up front. Muovetevi avanti. David Hardin, lead the troops. <laughs> Third is a little bit of a business gem that I would like to see spread through our community. La terza parte è più business related, quindi più relativa al business e voglio uh, parlare di questo alla nostra comunità. So, to start. Per iniziare. <laughs> If I am speaking to an Italian audience and they look at me like <laughs> Se sto parlando ad un pubblico italiano e mi guardano in quel modo là. I might, might not be sure that they understand me. Non sono sicuro che mi stiano capendo. So this is a technique that you may use. Quindi questa è una tecnica che potreste usare. To try to improve your ability to talk to business people to get money. E questa è una tecnica che potreste usare per parlare a gente sul, sul lavoro, nel business, per fare soldi. One of the challenges is that we, as designers, like to use complicated words, like CSS, API, HTML, lamp stack. Questo è perché come progettisti, come designer, usiamo parole complicate come CSS, HTML, API. But when I speak to someone like Hugh, as a perfect business gentleman, he does not understand. Ma un gentiluomo come Hugh potrebbe non capire. <laughs> <laughs> I 
That's the same. So we will keep your version. <laughs> I would like everyone to stand up. Per favore alzatevi in piedi. At your pair of tables, form a circle. So, two tables is a team. Make us as your chairs are facing, face each other as a circle. Mettetevi in cerchio intorno ad, a ciascuno dei due tavoli. If we have. Per favore riempite i tavoli nella parte anteriore. Quindi there are persone some che sono extra dietro. people in the back, please come forward and fill in this team. It needs more people. Ronnie, you too. Within your teams, let's do something challenging. Facciamo like pick a team leader. Scegliete un team leader in ciascuno in ciascuno dei team. To start this process, per iniziare questo processo, I would like each of the team leaders to put into your mind a shape. It is a shape. <laughs> it is the shape of a physical object. So what you are going to do, wait, I, I, I will repeat again so you can repeat. Okay, thanks. I'm going to say this first for the English audience. So what you are going to do is to use your hands and without any words, we'll have some quiet, without any words, you're going to communicate to your other team members what this shape is. And then you're going to give it to somebody else. So to demonstrate this, Tyler, come up here. All the way on stage, come on, run, run. Run! Yay! I'm going to give you a shape. And I want you to, to receive it from me the way I sent it to you. I'm going to give him a shape. Okay, ti darò una and I, forma. And I want him to receive it e the way la, I send it to him. E voglio che tu la riceva nello stesso modo in cui te la invio. The skill this requires is not a skill of me as the shape maker. La, <laughs> la, cap la, la capacità non è la, la richiesta, non è la mia come eh, mi Mimo, creatore di forme. The, the skill is in Tyler as he must be a very active listener, listening with his eyes. La capacità deve essere quella di Tyler. So as for each of your teams, as your team leader makes a shape, your listeners must be watching you very carefully or they won't know what it is. Quindi i vostri ascoltatori dovranno prestare molta attenzione ai team leader altrimenti non saranno in grado di capire qual è la forma che voi volete trasmettere. So let's start. I will make a shape to demonstrate. Iniziamo, faccio un esempio, una dimostrazione. I'm going to grab some space. Prendo dello spazio. And now you get to take that shape and turn it into another shape and deliver it back to me. 
quindi la trasformi in un'altra forma e me la mandi indietro. And I can make it into another shape and give it back to him. E la posso modificare in un'altra forma e la rimando a lui. For this skill to work, all of you must be active listeners, paying attention to the person who's about to present to you. And those who are forming shapes have to be very careful and very expressive to make sure the person is receiving the information you are sending. So watch their face to see if he looks very confused as he did the last time. <laughs> Quindi per assicurare una buona trasmissione dovete essere degli ascoltatori veramente attivi e prestare attenzione a tutti i movimenti che vengono fatti da chi vi sta trasmettendo la forma, altrimenti avrete un'espressione un po' confusa come quella che aveva prima lui. So team leaders, make your shape and get ready to give it to somebody else on your team. Team leaders, fatela, create la vostra forma e tra trasferitela a qualcun altro. Go! Via. Well done. Let's give Tyler a hand. As you pass the shape, pick another person in the team to receive so that everyone receives the shape at least once. Assicuratevi che la forma sia passata almeno una volta a tutti i membri della vostra squadra. Yeah, just put them on the table. <coughs> Leave me one like to demonstrate. I'll put it on the first table.
Okay, the person who has the shape now. Okay, chi adesso ha la forma? The person who has the shape now, would you please form it into a cloud and put it back up to the ceiling? <laughs> la persona che ha adesso la forma può restituirla. You may be seated. Per favore, riaccomodatevi. You guys need to get back in teams. No cheating back there. You guys have to get back in teams. David, Ritor round them all up. Get them on a team. Ritornate nel... Nei vostri Jennifer, team. Whoever, Jennifer is sleeping. She must come forward. This team ne right here needs help. They're, they have jug members in the group. You will like them. Part due. Seconda parte. Part two. Oh, seconda parte. <laughs> You're supposed to say part two. You should have said part two. Part two. <laughs> the Italian bridge. This is a competition. Il ponte italiano è una competizione, una sfida. Each team has two tables. Ogni squadra ha due tavoli. Each team has a package of nice American style dry spaghetti. Ogni, ogni squadra ha un pacchetto di I'm spaghetti americani. You also have a roll of tape. Avete anche un rotolo di nastro adesivo. Your challenge is to build a bridge between your two tables using these ingredients. La vostra, la competizione sta nel costruire il ponte usando questi due elementi. The winner will be the table. Hello. Il the vincitore. winner will be the table that has the largest gap covered by the bridge. Il, la squadra che vincerà sarà quella che ha coperto la maggior distanza tra i tavoli con il ponte. In case of a tie, hold up, hold up, hold on, come on. In caso di Time pareggio, you need a the first criteria is the distance between the tables. Il primo criterio è la distanza tra i tavoli. The second criteria in case there is a tie on distance, is height. In caso di pareggio, il secondo criterio sarà l'altezza. So, distance and height. Distezza, eh, distanza e altezza. With that, you have 10 minutes. 10 minutes, go. Avrete 10 minuti di tempo. I'm sorry. No, you're doing fine. It's okay. Don't you think
we have a clarification. Hello, rules clarification. Hello, hold for a moment. Time out, hold for a moment. Aspettate un secondo. You must have at least part of your span be only spaghetti. And uh, la distanza tra i tavoli deve essere coperta solo con spaghetti. I hear some of you are checking the internet for answers. That's okay. Potete cercare la soluzione su internet, va bene. <laughs> and I am proud to say that Ken Crowder, who was the officiant of our transition, is being the officiant of this event. He, whatever he says goes. <laughs> okay, quindi Ken Crowder, membro del nostro transition team, sarà il giudice di questo, l'arbitro di questa gara. Judge. Judge. Timer's right there. Oh, good, thank you. I don't know if you want to reset it or not, or you can wing it, just that's the 10 minute. Thank you. And you're using string? So, look at the thing with the eight. Copying what I'm doing. Doing okay? Yeah. This is good. Oh, I thought you were management. Good. Team leader. Nice idea. Yeah. Are, but this time it's too far for one package of spaghetti. You need more no, than no, one. No, 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 no. We are. Uh, yeah, do so uh, we can. We start with the rules. Spice together a short cut of all this stuff. Do we follow the rules as mentioned on stage? Okay. Yeah. That's fine. If you can write the card, I'd appreciate it. They have a problem, maybe assistance. <laughs> I know. Look at that. <laughs> I understand. That solved the issue. You're good. You're good. Uh, we did something like this no. last month at IBM, but not braces. But you have to create a self-standing structure with spaghetti and just a little bit of tape or glue. That's different. Sir. And you should put a marshmallow on top of the structure. And we built something like a, a wheel. Yeah. Yeah. So, 
Um, until I get back on stage, let's um, just have the hand mic live and leave my lab off. And I'll use it when I need it and just how it will Open. Open. We can make it up in here. The pasta portion, yes. It, it's so most, so most people have done. Yes, because they are not spaghetti. Spaghetti is è un problema di comunicazione tra benvenuto blocco di un e di un e vabbè io se vuoi io ero arrivato in base non costruire il ponte volevo parlare di quello di che un po' che stavamo pensando con Manzoni che l'abbiamo messo giù nella punta I e poi mi vedo sti invasioni di Valentini che onestamente non mi è piaciuta perché mi devo nascondere? È la verità, perché e tra l'altro pomeriggio dove dovevano tutti contribuire a giungla e non alle associazioni è stata fatta una cosa che li ha tenuti nel recinto ed è stato brutto, per questo io sono andato a dire andate nelle altre parti, vedete cosa si può fare. Tyler. So we are here at the JWC competition and we are dialing in on this particular group to understand their design technique. Now, <laughs> there is no design technique, it's just uh, let's try to build a bridge, <laughs> any bridge. Any bridge. And this is the designer saying there is no design technique. It's awesome. It's the best design ever. It's magic. It's all about magic. So you are using a wrapping technique. Can you tell me a little about it? I don't know. I don't know. It's similar to Whatever works. And the target is moving, I see. I will leave this and I will take it when uh, are you using that one? Mm, yes. And, and what part, what role will this part play? Second floor. Second floor? <laughs> ah. So. They're building up the house. Will, will that floor have the restaurant and the uh, piano bar? Yes. <laughs> no, not yet. No? What about all those souvenirs you can buy on, on the Ponte <laughs> Vecchio? Oh. 
we have some young Joomlers in this team who are working together to uh, to create a. a she's the team leader. She's the team leader. Yes. What's the team leader's name? Grace. I'm, my name is Grace. And tell us a little bit about the project. Well, we're just trying to put two pieces of tape across and lay spaghetti out on top of it. That's all. Excellent. And whose idea was this? All of our ideas. All of you. Very good. Pretty good distance going. I like it. Wait, does it count if it touches the ground because they're using chairs? Well, I don't know. We might have to check that out. Shall we wander to the back? Or can you get to the far corner or not? No. Explain the rules. First pack should be spaghetti only. It should not be tape based. That's what you said. I'm going to let our judge figure that out. Oh, it's one of those. You want to do another one? Sure. Who do you want to go to? So Duke, so this is an American competition where you adjust the rules in hindsight? To Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. Absolutely necessary to change the rules after we have started okay. uh, because we changed the materials after we started. The original composition was to be spaghetti yeah. and marshmallows as the joining material. Yeah, you, yeah, that would never have made it to Duke. I would have eaten all the marshmallows before. <laughs> <laughs> it works very well, but uh, tape, yeah, unfortunately, is uh, way too much. Know. Yes, I know. But. How much time do we have left? Until most groups look like they're done. Sorry? Until most groups look like they're done. Another three, four minutes. This looks like it is a very scientific approach. Who wants to tell me about this design? We're still in beta now. Uh, very alpha, maybe. Alpha stage, OK. So what's, what's this going to look like when you're done? We, we recognize that there's no chance of winning the length competition, so we're going for height. Excellent. <laughs> Excellent. We might have to have two prizes. Our core is stable. Our core is fantastic. An objective of a stable core. I am impressed. <laughs> ah. We have a design here that is looking most like an Italian bridge. It's, I think it's going to get the award for most, most authentic in design. Uh, clearly Leonardo inspired, uh, very clever construction. Who can tell me about this design? It seems to be sagging. Want to tell me about it? No? Somebody? Anyone? They keep putting pieces on and they're hoping it's not going to fall down. We have a group here who is not even going to span between the tables. They have a fully supported structure. This, this is clearly a stack server that has all of its security intact. <laughs> so who wants to tell me about this design? So the X's, in theory, will brace it so the in-between joints won't bend when we put it across the table. Excellent. That's it. And are you just going across this table or actually going no, to go across two gonna, tables? It's going to go across, but <laughs> this, the X's, make it so it won't bend. Fine. Excellent. They protect the joints. More distance uh, for me. And on this side, we have another design going on. So what's happening over here? It's just being concertinaed back down again. We're starting again. You're refactoring. We're refactoring, exactly, based on what we've learned so far. So, so what are the design criteria of the refactoring? What, what uh, were the issues found in, in the first release that you're now? Soggy bottoms are not a good idea. Oh, who sat in water? Pardon? Who sat down in water? <laughs> no, it's a joke. A sa a sagging bridges is not a good idea because okay. they fall through the, the gaps. So now we decided to get rid of that. All right, and uh, we tried knitting. What component is this to, and how are these going to work together? No. <laughs> yeah. Oh. <laughs> this is an example of JavaScript in the yeah, making. Excellent. It's totally open source. Total random chaos. All right, we're going to call three minutes to closure. Three minutes.
Three minutes. Three minutes. Three minutes. Bridge between two chairs there. Ken, Tyler. Tyler. Long shot. Just give me a long shot from there. So we've discovered yet another bridging technique, the bridge between two chairs, someone who's getting the proper Joomla rest and uh, relaxation. So why are you back here? Um, are, you, are you just being inspired? Are you having your Da Vinci moment? Exactly. And, and what's, what's coming out of this? Uh, I forgot. <laughs> ah, same, same as always. Great. Same as always. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Uh huh. They're using chairs to hold uh -huh. it. Tell me if you if you No, you're the you're the judge. You call it. Okay, I see. And I don't care if we give lots of different prizes. Oh, okay. We don't have to have one winner. It's, oh, okay. So, so do like original design, uh, longest span, highest, uh, uh, most you, authentic Italian. Highest. So longest, which would be now? Come up as many categories you can think of. You know what? You get to decide. That. It's all right. Sorry. I haven't decide. seen them all, so I'm, I haven't seen them all, so I'm relying on you. Okay, great. So you can you decide the winner. But there's just a long list. The long is still standing. All right. Sorry about that. <laughs> One minute. One minute. One minute. One minute. Oh, that is good. What did it do? Broken? Tyler, when you get a chance to that corner, have you shot the bat corner? Oh, what is the name of this team? Do you have a name? The name is Tower Bridge. Excellent. Tower Bridge. And what was the inspiration for this design? We build it upon the Roman Empire uh, idea. We make an art and, and also the collaboration. Excellent. Nicely done. This is clever. Well done. Beautiful. No, you cannot use the laptop. Oh, we have an arch in, we have an arch in process. Guys, guys. Inspired by the shape of archways. I like this. Oh, check it out. Freestanding, stable, long strands with, that, with spaghetti to hold it all. Very good. It's good engineering dynamics in there. Use of triangles. Excellent. Well done. Oh, we have a partial structural failure. Oh, no. Will they get it back together in time? And we're counting down. Ten. Everyone. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. We're done. Hands off. <laughs> Apparently, the group on this corner. As best we can, let's have everyone take a seat.
Find a seat so you can see all the bridges. Accomodatevi per favore. And the winner is. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> We're not done. We're not done. We're going to quickly go around the room and look at a couple of these competition. Uh, entries that have been done so very well. Ken, get on up here with me so we can talk a little bit about it. We have a little huddle of the, the official judge and, and the uh, kibitzer, who's kibitzer in chief who gets to change the rules as we make it up. And so together, of course, Ken did determine that this is the longest supported span, but the goal was an unsupported span. Yeah. But, but this does have, there is. And so the part that will count is the length of the span, from the span at the table to the first chair. So that will count as length. <laughs> Come on up here, Ken. Now, among the interesting features that are down here is this group has managed to spell out Joomla in their span structures across the bridge. Oh. Parth, tell me about your design. So what we have here is a structurally sound design because we have used triangles and it looks beautiful. It does look beautiful. It has used triangles very effectively and it has gone for height. That looks like two and a half strands tall. That is a, an impressive uh, feat in, all by itself. There's not many that are competing for height so you're, you're probably in the running for that one. Let's look at the next one over here. What do we got over here? Go. This is a suspended bridge. Uh, it can stand one uh, in the mountains uh, in a high altitude. It's for Tarzan. Yeah. Yeah. A nice solid suspension bridge cable. <laughs> Forgot to hang the bridge underneath it, though. <laughs> it is higher, so I do appreciate that you've managed to elevate the platforms on both sides without providing any stairs for the guests to get to it. So this is a, you get to climb your mountain and then cross. This is good. Invisible stairs. This is like our code. Constantly improving and you never see the change. That's good. All right, what's going on over here? Who's ready? Uh, so this one was officially the longest and the tallest but you came a bit too late. So now it's the shortest and the flattest. <laughs> so I think the uh, intention of, of the design patterns, the designs is, is that the triangles are supposed to be vertical. Yes, we, we can try and stand it up again. Uh, have you heard of pyramids? <laughs> Let's look at this one over here. So tell me about this design. Uh, well, it's a... Team effort. <laughs> Spider web, yeah. Yeah, it's a grid. It's based on the CSS grid. I'm impressed with the, uh, the matrix that you have built across here. The matrix is real. I can see it carried across in the design. Well done. And over here, what have we got going? It's a very bad design, very bad bridge. I'm not from the team. I'm not from the team. I'm not from the team. It's a very badly designed. A ringer. A ringer. You're sliding in here and skewing the scale. No, no, no. What are you? Are you from WordPress? <laughs> Drupal. We built this bridge two and a half thousand years ago, but due to 
uh, geological environment and uh, rain, it's still broken, just like the Colosseum here in Rome. As well. Oh, so this is a ruin. Yeah. yeah. Truly ruined. Yeah. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> oh, what do we have going on over here? Functionally flat. Tell me about this one. In honor, in honor of the people of Rome, we build a real Da Vinci bridge. So it's not very large, but at least we honor Rome. Excellent. Nicely done. <laughs> Team leader Grace is in charge of this group. Grace, you want to tell us about this one? Yeah, we're supposed to do a two-piece bridge across two roads, but it just fell apart. <laughs> Redundancy. Yeah. We built it with redundancy in mind. It's Excellent. Secure, just More like Joomla. No one touch it. It's the yeah. only So we have Joomla 3, the strong, stable suspension side, and, and Joomla Next still thinking about it. Maybe <laughs> might get there. <laughs> Not sure. <laughs> All right, let's move to the group back here. No. No. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. We. Oh. <laughs> oh, we have we have an official sighting that there was a glimpse of a real project here. Just it was momentary. It was fleeting, but then it forked. <laughs> Very good. And in the back corner, we have. St something structurally interesting. Who wants to talk about it? Me again? Okay. Uh, first of all, it was a great teamwork. We get uh, we get a very strong infrastructure. I really and it's stable. And uh, I really trust my team. And uh, and uh, how you said uh, we we can test, take it for a test drive to see how it's strong it is. Let me show you. It still stands, you know, it stands still. <laughs> it passed the vibration test. Well done. And back over here, how are we doing? Fine. Tell me about it. Uh, George can talk about it. George can talk about anything. So, uh, as you know, we like building strong, stable structures in Joomla, and uh, this is a perfect example. Excellent. <laughs> The bridge is very uh, unresponsive, though. <laughs> it, it will not Mobile respond up. to shifts in, in the uh, platform, huh? Yeah. Darn. <laughs> Who wants to talk about this one? This looks like a classic design. Who's ready? Go for it. This is the strongest uh, bridge here. And this is an, uh, in, in the original Italian bridge. Uh, you can see the, the form. Excellent. All right, thank you very much. We are now going to declare everyone a winner and let you break your bridges and get your chairs back. Yes, who wants to run through this bridge? Go through it. Let it fly. If we're done at 10 up, are we okay? Yeah, we're completely done, including the part there. As in moving? Yeah. Okay. All right, everyone, take it down. Have a seat. Per favore, riaccomodatevi. Per favore, riaccomodatevi. Rompete i ponti e riaccomodatevi. Okay, we have limited time, so let's uh, take it down a level. Per favore, riaccomodatevi. We'll wrap up.
just because of this thing. All right, how was that for fun? Everyone give me a yay! yay. Good. We have about six minutes left to this part. So we're going to go into part three. And we're going to do it short and sweet. Questa è la terza parte. Abbiamo solamente sei minuti per affrontare questa parte del discorso. This portion of the talk is about tip your server. It is that when you are dealing with a web server, you will get better performance of all your websites if you tilt it up and put a 2 by 4 under it. Quando avete a che fare con dei server, se li inclinate, avete qualche risultato in più. What? You don't agree? Oh, uh, it's supposed to have better airflow. Può avere una può essere areato meglio. All right. I guess I've been busted. You're right. It's not a 2 by 4 it takes a 4 by 4 <laughs> No. Instead, I want to talk about tipping your server as in a waiter at a restaurant. Ma potete anche dare una mancia al vostro server come fate ai ristoranti. Unlike some other parts of the world, in the United States, it is customary to tip a waiter. In alcuni paesi, come negli Stati Uniti, è un'usanza comune eh, dare delle mance. This is to recognize that not only did the waiter contribute to an excellent evening and experience, but there were more people, like the busboy, like the sous chef in the kitchen, like the purveyors that delivered the food. Non è solo per riconoscere l'ottimo lavoro del cameriere che vi ha servito la cena, per, ma è anche nei confronti, diciamo, di tutte quelle persone che hanno collaborato dal fornitore del, eh, dallo chef al fornitore del, delle materie prime. Open source software is very similar. Il software We, open... Oh. Il software open source è molto simile. In that we as site builders, site designers that deliver to a customer, we rely on a lot of people that are behind the scenes. Quando i designer, i progettisti e gli sviluppatori consegnano un sito al cliente, fanno affidamento a tutte quelle persone che sono dietro al, al palcoscenico. As a designer, I do not want to reinvent the wheel. So I am very happy we have many extensions on the JED that are free, low cost, even high cost. But they all help me do a better job. Come progettista non mi piace reinventare la ruota, ma posso fare affidamento su tutte le estensioni gratis e a pagamento che sono sulla JED e mi consentono di rilasciare un buon prodotto al cliente. As site designers and builders, we wear many more hats than our customers ever realize. I didn't get Too many jobs that we have to do. Our customers want a pretty page and a design and don't really think about other things we deliver, like speed, performance, clean code, security. Il cliente non si rende conto nel dettaglio di tutti i servizi che forniamo insieme a una bella pagina. Non, fanno, non, non si rendono conto che c'è anche la, la velocità, l'ottimizzazione e altro. So the point being is that we all ride the sh on the shoulders of giants. The people in our community who create the core code and create all of our extensions. Quindi siamo tutti quanti sulle, 
spalle dei nostri giganti che creano il codice del core di Joomla e delle estensioni. I have learned that our developers must eat from all the four major food groups. Uh, well, um, yes, Red Bull, Doritos, pizza, Hot Pockets, and even ramen. I nostri sviluppatori mangiano quattro grandi categorie o tipi di, di cibo. A challenge we have in our open source community is with GPL licensing and the fact that there is no automatic revenue model for free and open source software. Una delle sfide che come software open source abbiamo davanti è quella con la licenza. In, infatti non c'è un modo diretto per fare delle revenue, dei guadagni su, sul software. We love that our software is free, as in free beer. Doesn't always work that way. So the point being is that we need to help our ecosystem, our chain of people who are involved in our community, make a good living so they're still here next year. Quindi ci piace il free, il libero come eh, nella birra, ma dobbiamo aiutare le, i nostri sviluppatori a continuare a fornire il loro prezioso lavoro. So I'm going to give a couple suggestions that you can use as designers who deal with an end customer. One is that even though you might buy your software in one of these two categories, that for every client you have, you charge this category and you pay it to the people who built the software. So they are paid for every site their software went on, as your choice. Avete la possibilità di far pagare ai vostri clienti le due categorie sulla destra, ma voi pagate quella che è a sinistra per il singolo sito. Another suggestion is to use, a, use the concept of tipping, so that as you quote a website, you don't mention it at the beginning because you're trying to compete for the bid. But when you are done, you add the idea of an optional gratuity. No, potete, potete considerarlo anche come opzione alla fine di un lavoro, quello di eh, dare indietro un, una mancia, un, un qualcosa indietro a chi vi ha consentito di fare quel lavoro. This can be totally voluntary for your client, but it is to reinforce the idea that part of the software that is business critical to their business came from people who donated their time and donated their code. Potete anche dirlo ai vostri clienti che una parte del software che avete utilizzato che è stata utilizzata e sul quale fanno affidamento per le loro applicazioni anche critiche deriva da software free. I have done this by saying at the end of the, the project adding a 18% fee to the bill and setting up a PayPal account on the client's credit card to pay tips to the developers whose free software was included in the sites. L'ho fatto con alcuni clienti impostando una percentuale del 18% come mancia e creando un account PayPal per dare eh, indietro dei, dei soldi agli sviluppatori del free software che era stato utilizzato. Together we can make people like George Wilson have an income. <laughs> per consentire a persone come George Wilson di avere un'entrata. So at the end of the day I simply invite you to consider the idea of tipping your server and in doing so I in all the times I have presented this idea to a client of mine no one has said no. They have, every one of them has been happy to give a donation instead of have to redesign their website a year from now because, a donation, because an extension is no longer supported. E questo è un concetto che molti clienti hanno apprezzato per, al posto di rifare il proprio sito per una estensione che non era più supportata. 
Thank you for joining me in building the Italian bridge.